in this lunchtime. Two of Britain's brightest tennis talents are going head-to-head -head for the first time this afternoon. We'll have updates from Heather Watson's match against Laura Robson. On Sky Sports HD1. Now we're keeping you across uh, this match in Barnstable. It's the uh, GB Pro Series. It's the second round and it's the first ever time that Laura Robson there and Heather Watson have ever met. Two up-and-coming players, of course, in British women's tennis. The uh, current situation after Laura Robson won the first set very, very convincingly 6-1, uh, then Heather Watson won the second one 6-3, is that Laura Robson has just, in the uh, sixth game, broken her opponent, so she's now serving for a 5-2 lead. Just a bit of background on these two players, of course. Uh, Heather Watson, she's older by two years. Uh, she won the US Open uh, junior title. Uh, in 2009 when she was age 17. She was outgunned a little bit though by uh, Laura Robson, who you will remember back in 2008, she won the Wimbledon girls tournament. She was only 14 then, and at the moment she is having the better of it. We're gonna be speaking uh, to the winner between these two. They've only met this first time uh, today, and uh, we'll speak to the winner. It's uh, gathering a little bit of um, Gathering a bit of attention there behind uh, in Barnstable. You can see the crowd uh, just standing uh, behind. We'll just see this point. Laura Robson serving now, having broken in the sixth game. She uh, aiming to uh, take a 5-2 lead in this uh, third decisive set. And that uh, two-handed backhand from uh, Heather Watson Long. So there is that uh, lead for Laura Robson, 5-2 in the deciding set. We'll uh, bring you up to date with uh, if she wraps it up in the next game. Exciting stuff. Now coming up, we're with Mick McCarthy as his Wolf side prepare to face Manchester City twice in four days. So, on Sunday. Straight to Barnstable and the winning moment has uh, just occurred in the first ever meeting between uh, Heather Watson and uh, Laura Robson on the uh, left-hand side there. Laura Robson, of course, uh, the uh, younger of the two, 17 years old, Heather Watson, 19 years old, and Laura Robson, has just won. She uh, won 5-3, 6-3 I should say, in the uh, final set. She won the first set 6-1, uh, then Heather Watson uh, fought back 6-3 in the uh, second set, but now Laura Robson has won it 6-3 in that uh, decisive set. So she now moves on to uh, face the winner of uh, Naomi Brody and uh, Ekaterina Baichakova. The uh, Russian in the uh, third round, so uh, Heather Watson is out, Laura Robson is through. We can see the, uh, the winning point, the uh, match point for uh, Laura Robson, who uh, broke decisively in the uh, final set in the sixth game. And it was, uh, it was an unforced error in the end. Uh, Heather Watson, I think it was this one, just going long, that uh, two-handed backhand over the baseline and victory for Laura Robson. As I said, the first time they've ever met. This is the uh, second tier of uh, women's tennis, of course, the ITF circuit. So they kick on. Now, Laura Robson goes on, Heather Watson out. Uh, we'll be speaking uh, to the two players, or maybe just the one of them, a little bit later on. Back to the League Cup and stoked. And Laura Robson has beaten Heather Watson in three sets at the Barnstable Open. It's the first time the pair have met, and we're hoping to hear from Robson shortly. Indeed we are now. Sir Alex Ferguson with other clubs in the new year unless he signs a new contract. We'll have an update from Neil Lennon shortly. The women's world number one tennis players want grunting outlawed. More on that on the way. And find out who came out on top in the first competitive meeting. Grunts and all between Laura Robson and Heather Watson. <laughs> 